Hey guys and welcome back to Tweetopia, my current playthrough on City Skylines. And the problem that we left left with last time was very much this traffic snarl over here. The main problem is that this is kind of the commercial area around here. Uh, and it's the main catchment for all of this area. So all these guys, and including these that are also residential, come down through here and try and come over this bridge and into this section over here. Now thankfully not too many of them are actually going straight across here, uh, this way down here. We can tell this because like massive snarling tailback suddenly disappears here, whereas we've still got like quite a lot of traffic on the go around there. Plus, I've also just kind of watched them a lot. I've spent a long time watching these guys. And short of a complete redevelopment of this triangle, which is going to happen, don't, don't, uh, don't threat there. We are going to completely redevelop that area. I think I've come up with a solution or two of what we can do here. Now, the first one is we need to get these guys off the roundabout because they're, they're what's snarling this up. There is absolutely no need. They could just kind of go up and over there. Uh, how are we going to do that? is going to be subject to debate. I think the first thing we're going to do is we're going to move this playground. Uh, we might actually move it down here somewhere. Might, the, the, the residents might like it a little bit more than the uh, offices and stuff. I'm thinking... Oh, this is not very useful. It's just a little bit too big for all the... Ah, there we go. For all the spaces I've allowed. I'm not sure if this is exactly where I want to put it. Maybe we want to just kind of nail this, uh, this road back here. That might be a better way of doing it. Okay. So grab that, move that over here, and that should make something a little bit more pretty for these guys. Yeah, yeah, in fact it does. Very much so. Okay, so we moved that out of the way so we can have a little bit of room uh, to build some road networks and stuff like that in. We, we are actually going to need them. Uh, I'm just trying to see if there is a bus stop along this route anywhere. There's one there. Because something else that could really ease a bit of the congestion here would it be, I don't know, maybe some sort of foot passage over this way. Uh, and I'm thinking down this one. This, this is the smallest building. We've also got an abandoned building over here. So let's just throw not that one. Of course not that one. Let's just throw a quick pathway in from here. Is that going to allow? Oh, that is actually going to allow me to do that. That's beautiful beautiful we'll go up and over the train line here and i think we're gonna carry on being a raised surface maybe if we could come down in between those two um let's just try and get a little bit of a sweeping curve on what we're doing here because we, we don't want it to look too like that's what i'm looking for regimented too too straight uh i i know that if we go too mad on the curves it can look funny but I think that is oh, may, maybe a little bit funny. Is that a bit wavy? It it looks like a real one does. I'll tell you that. This is this is definitely something that would have been designed by someone in the real world. Okay, let's figure out how we're going to get this other one coming. I, I'm probably going to go down this little line here, I'm feeling. From here? Is this where we need to go? Is it going to allow us to do that? It does. Do we want a straight line and just kind of come... Ra no, does it not like that? Oh, it's because I was in the curving whilst I was on the straight. I see what was going there. Okay, so we go like that, that, and that. These bumpy road, bumpy surfaces, not ideal. Maybe we can cover them up with some trees or something. Uh, what have we got over here? This looks like the good spot to come down into. Uh, unless we can squeeze through there. No, I don't, I don't think we will. So let's just kind of straight line. I don't know. Can we go all the way across? We can't really. Let's go there, there there and then oh if we could come off of this snap that would be useful and then down to the edge there okay now hopefully these are going to get well used uh, this one oh wow look this one already has quite a few people on it unfortunately the uh, siren count is high around here as well I, I like the way that they get to look over the uh, the cargo route this is this is quite nice okay what we've got going over here obviously this has only just been put down so I'm not expecting people to be using it straight away but that straight away people are using it really need to do something about these bumps uh, maybe we could pull it out a bit more I mean look at that Look at that. I don't know. Well, we're not really going to be paying attention to them, are we? Is there anywhere else that would be um, 
make use of one. I mean, we've got tons of tiny apartments down here. Uh, and is this also residential? Maybe we could put something going in across here, especially if we've got... Oh, no, it's a firehouse. I thought it was going to be an elementary school. Maybe we could move this to this side. I don't know if that's going to have too much of a negative impact. I don't know. People said it did, but we, we, don't, we don't know. Uh, and just quickly throw in a few paths along here. I like these paths. I think they're a nice addition to the to the game. Uh, not. Ooh, do we want to do an underground tunnel? Is that a thing we can do? Well, it's a thing that we can do. Is it a thing that we want to do? Uh, I'm going to go from there. No, slope too steep. Uh, slope too steep. Okay, well, we'll pull this back just a bit. That's unfortunate. I have to get the, get rid of the whole lot at once. Uh, it would have been nice just to do a little bit. Uh, let's page up, of course. Uh, put this grid snap back on because it's a lot easier when I do that. Let's try this far back. And then when we go and put the next one down, it should hopefully fit in there. Okay, sweet. Uh, now, we're going to need space to make the path come up here. So I'm thinking... Why, why is it not... Does it not like this? Am I not allowed to do this? Why not? Let's try and re-put that path down. I know pathways are a little bit awkward anyway. Look, it's trying to delete that every time I do it. So let's go from there. There we go. Okay, for some reason it, it never likes overlapping pathways. So I'm going to go to here and then do an up. Coming that way, hopefully. Slope too steep. Ah, oh, that's a shame it needs to go just a little bit that far. So like that. Is that something that's, that's a good one? Yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. And I hope you guys do as well. Uh, let's throw down a few trees, because trees are good. They also fill in these uh, big empty spaces. Can I not put a tree there? That is unfortunate, actually. That, that suddenly, uh, suddenly thrown me off my game. All right, anyway. Back over to the main problem here. We've managed to alleviate a little bit of the traffic congestion. Uh, I'm not sure how much, and I'm not sure how much I like this. I think I might actually end up doing a bridge going over anyway. But, what are we going to do here? Well, it's going to be quite brutal. It, I say quite brutal. It is going to be very, very brutal. We're going to take a line from here, uh, come out like this, page it up. Uh... That's as far as we can come out there. Okay, that's fine. We're going to do this. Hmm, how do I want to enter this? Now, ideally, we want to come in here, come over to the end here somehow, and then... Can we page down? We can't page down. Let's, let's bring this back to this thing. Uh, let's go to the edge here. Get in nice and close so we can see what's going on. Um... Now I'd like to page down and kind of... Nah, I won't do that. Maybe this? Okay, we're going to have to do some juggling to make that perfect. But I think that's a good start. Let's speed up the simulation and see what happens. Now obviously these guys, they all know where they're going. So it's going to... Ow, ow, it backs up onto there. So it's going to take some time for them to uh, move properly. Uh, it's for the new guys to come through that think they that think they want to take this. At the moment, everyone thinks they want to take this route. But I'm hoping, because it's the same type of road, this one will be a more direct route for most people. That's what, that's what I'm banking on, anyway. Okay, so there we go. We're starting to get our first bits of traffic. There are people out there who want to come down this way. Uh, and it seems like a fairly smooth interaction so far, but we, we will let it play out, obviously. Uh, the hearse was some of the first to take uh, effects of that. I like that. Um, maybe we could do something with the flow of traffic around it, because you see we've got like things like this where people are, are holding up here. Now, I'm fairly sure if I was to upgrade this, that should aid flow quite considerably, I hope. Uh, we'll go across this way. Something like that, yeah, yeah, that, that seems good to me. Now this seems also seems like a little bit of a problem, but I think we can address that, depending on where this bus stops. Okay. Hmm, might be a bit of a problem with the bus route round here once I've uh, thought about things. But we will think about them on the way. Uh, I am going to upgrade some new road. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is to drop in some new road here. Yeah, because look, I, I, I was fairly sure this would be a problem. Um, where these guys are wanting to turn down this way, they're all starting to back up. So I think what we can do here to fix that 
is more judicious use of one one way roads yet yeah, so now everybody has to go up this way uh, and that should speed everyone up hopefully that is the plan let's just make this all one way road let's make it official shall we there we go that that should do fairly well okay let's speed through time and see what's going on maybe sort out a few more bridges while we're at it i mean where else could people do with some footpath traffic like th this sort of area is probably somewhere i mean this is areas of high employment and it appears to be low access so let's see what we can do about that these pathways are basically the uh the easy quick fix for almost any uh sort of travel problems for you guys uh that's not so great do that and then oh, no it's not going to let me come through here unscathed but that's okay we can deal with that uh, and maybe up along the back of these to then come in like that I feel like this could be a nice curve instead let's let's see if we can't take care of that uh, we will need a straight line coming downwards there is there is no doubt about that at all somewhere to like here and then maybe just ease her down and across at a right angle-ish. There we go, that looks a little bit better. Looks a little bit better. We could definitely do with more more roads on the, uh, more pathways on the go, just so these ones don't stand out quite so much. That said, I have no idea where to go. Um, we've, got, we've got one coming up here. Oh wow, look, at, look, at, look how busy it is. That is exceedingly busy. Right, the one we needed to sort out was to make sure that this pathway it does a double loop through here, but I think we can. I can think think we can safely deal with that. If we could somehow have another road coming in and we get up, down, up, down, that might be a thing. But we we don't really have the room for that, so I, I don't think that's really going to work like that. But nicely hooked up to the travel network. So the next problem we appear to have is uh, electricity. Of course, buildings are get abandoned all over the place, as they would do if electric is going to be such a problem. Why is electric such a problem? Let's have a look. We are just consuming too much. Okay, right, let's have a look at our power options. Like, this hydroelectric dam, I think, has caused us more problems than it has solved. Uh, if I come out of here, you can see that, like, it has stopped our flow, okay? It has come down, which has meant this has started backflowing, and this over here has started backflowing. It's kind of separated out into, like, separate chunks now. This one's kind of drifted down here. Why doesn't this one drift down there? I'll tell you why, because this river has been dammed, and there's not enough backflow going. Uh, and to top it all off, it only brings us 16 megawatts of power. 16 megawatts. Like, look at this one. He does uh, 20 20 you know I can I can deal with that so I think what we're gonna do we're gonna run this and we're gonna just demolish that whilst we already have you know water problems we're gonna do that now what are we gonna do to replace that this is a very interesting question I think probably we're gonna go for solar because we've been keeping quite a clean city feel to this place uh, I, I feel like we have anyway and we got like this area over here that there's quite a nice little utility island at the moment the problem of course is access uh, I'm feeling maybe a track across here we, we could just slowly throw a few things down I don't think we're so hard up for money that we're gonna not be able to do this so let's just throw something like this can that go all the way over there it does can we not get a fancier bridge well I suppose it's just a utility line uh, and then Hmm, what have we got? Utility line. Do we want to, do we want to give the utility line access to this? I think we might. I think we might. We'll do it like this. We'll start with a, a small bridge here with a little bit little tag on each side. Yep, that works for me. And then we just throw in some some on and off ramps. Beautiful. All right, and then we just want to uh, drag this out to the other side over there. All right, so this route should give us access to this bit over here. If we just kind of throw a little T-junction on the end, we can then start building off here. Uh, yeah, maybe something more like that. Because, of course, not only are we going to need the actual power generation itself, which is an important part of what we're doing here. Let's not be mistaken. There? That looks good. That's pretty good to me. Uh, but we're also going to have other issues up here. How can you not have power? This is a massive power tower. I mean, look how much power it actually does as well. Look at that, perfect. It's, it's, it's doing almost half of the power production in, on its own. That's amazing. Um, and it's always daytime at the moment, so that should be pretty good. Uh, how is this tidal wave progressing? It's slumped. Should have watched that. Sorry, guys. Um, 
I don't know why I didn't watch that. I thought I'd be able to come across and do that and then come back and look. But look, here it is. It's um quite underwhelming, actually, really, isn't it? That's that's unfortunate. I want to see what it does when it interacts with this. This is this is my main concern here. All right, the next thing we need to do in the uh, power cleanup uh, run is try and get all this. I mean, just just look there. This is disgusting. This is not the sort of behaviour we like to have in one of our secondary uh, commercial areas here, especially so close to such a beautiful monument such as this. Uh, where else can we just wipe all these out? Like we've got a main metro connection here. We don't we don't want all these abandoned buildings here. Hopefully, just by wiping a load of this out, we should. Encourage some more growth. Yeah, yeah no, this, this is doing it. Okay, uh, I think there was also a little bit of trouble down this way. Okay, awesome. So we just need to have a little bit of a look around, make sure everything's doing the things that it should be doing. We're getting some good buildings here. I do wonder what level we're coming at. Coming in at. Uh, no level info at the moment. We're doing all right. First level. It's not ideal. I should imagine we're missing. Uh, a few things like fire protection, yeah, uh, no, this is healthcare, not... Is healthcare needed in the commercial sector? It kind of is, right? Customers need need healthcare, right? We've got fire stations in, in Mad's presence around here, police station as well. Uh, education's not really needed, though it is close by. Transportation, I'm not, I'm not even going to get get into the transport. Uh, we, we just need to do something to, to up this area's value at some point. Okay, another thing that I really want to just quickly take care of is we've got massive traffic snarls around here. And I think maybe one-way streets might be our saviour here. So if we, like, nominate, I don't know, this point here, we, we kind of start a little loop going. I reckon we can have two little loops. We have a little one here, this, this one here, and then we have a slightly larger one coming up down here, uh, down past this and out, and we'll, we'll see what happens there. Uh, that should hopefully work wonders for us. Okay, first thing, which way are the traffic going? That way, good. Uh, I'm going to do this one first. We're going to go all the way up here. Should hopefully all just line up in the direction I want to go. Uh, and we'll see what effect this has on flow. Uh, my, the main thing I'm trying to do here is stop the crossings of the traffic here. So if we also... So hang on, this, this came down straight here. Let, let's carry on going this way. Is that the right direction? There appear to be people going in the wrong direction. Let's turn that. I'm not impressed with the fact that it keeps trying to put it down in the wrong direction with me. I've got to like place down the one-way road and then revert it to the other direction. Uh, right, something else I want to do. Let's just take a little pause here. Get rid of this. It, it, it'll be a shame to see some of these businesses go. They've been here for a very long time. But I want to put in a little junction like this. I know this is. Uh, this looks like it's going to cause us more trouble. Ooh, ooh that's a uh, that's an interesting uh, arrangement there. Maybe something like this. Okay, well we'll we'll have that, I suppose. It's not great, is it? It's not great, but we we will make do with it. Uh, and we are going to upgrade this to one-way roads as well. We're going to have these going all in the same direction. This way, please. Thank you. Why is it doing it that that way again? I, I say, I say, and then hopefully, if just a, a few one-way roads go in the right place, we should be able to ease the flow. Let's start the traffic up again. Which way is this going? It's the wrong way. That's that's which way that's going. In the wrong way. Now, hopefully, everything should come down here. Oh, I think I see a little bit of a, a future issue. Um, things are going to get a little bit busy right here, right? Just have a look at this. Uh, everything's merging into the one place. I think what we kind of need here is like three lanes of traffic coming off it. Of course, that's going to be a little bit awkward there. Look at this. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know. It kind of looks okay. A roundabout would definitely be a winner here. But this, of course, will mean that we need to uh, move this landfill here. And how are we doing with moving the congestion? Well, it's kind of working and it's kind of not. I like the way that all this is now flowing, but they are going round and up. So where are they coming from and how do we get them to where they need to go? I bet it's something to do with this path here. 
I, know, I think I'm going to need some more time to think about this. And indeed, I think this whole area is actually going to be up for redevelopment. We need to get some sort of proper uh, industrial area undergo. Some, something that's got some like thought behind it. Because obviously this this train station here is where everyone wants to... Oh, well, you just... No, I think I've made it worse. I think I've made it worse. Anyway, I will see you guys next time when we are going to try and take care of all this. Bye!